Justice still awaits a teacher run over by a former royal in Chhattisgarh three days ago. Police has announced a reward of a measly 5,000 rupees for information on Vikramaditya Singh Jade, a step which has expectedly not worked. Meanwhile, the accused elder brother, a member of parliament of the ruling BJP, has opted for political correctness and distanced himself conveniently from his brother. Three days after allegedly trying to kill a man by running over him with his SUV, this man, Vikramaditya Judo, a former royal in Chhattisgarh, is still absconding. But political pressure at least got his elder brother, Ranvijay Singh Judo, a BJP Rajya Sabha MP, to visit the victim's family. The elder brother distancing himself from his absconding sibling. Whosoever does wrong, uh, the police uh, should take action and uh, uh, I would uh, request uh, him through you all that he should come uh, uh, before the police and uh, he should surrender himself. On Monday morning at around 9.30 from the Judev royal family Vikramaditya Singh he came here along with his two associates and he thrashed the school director Brahmeshwar Gupta and this is a disputed piece of land this is a 35 dismal piece of land which the Gupta family believe, claim that they purchased from the royal family 10 years back and they were in the process of constructing a school building here and Vikramadit Singh was coming here often and he was asking the Gupta family to return this piece of land and because of which there was so much of dispute that was going on Tension, meanwhile, continues across the district with no signs of accused. Ex royal surfacing anytime soon. Protests broke out in front of Judeo's palace and a band was declared across the city. We have made a team from here and from here. And wherever we can, we are giving our team a lot of damage. The, the, the condition of the victim, Parmeshwar Gupta, remains critical. Three days later, he is still on ventilator in the ICU, but shockingly, the family seems still under the sway of Judas, the royalty. There is a sense of fear of the royal family that is prevailing amongst the locals in Jashpur, and that is why not many are willing to come out in the open and speak against them. But justice is what that they want now. The arrest of the royal scion, Vikramaditya Singh, is what they are demanding. With camera person Deepak Kumar, this is Rohit Singh in Jashpur, in Chhattisgarh for headlines today. I want to take you straight live to our correspondent Rohit Singh who is with us uh, tonight from Jashpur where this ghastly incident happened and from where Vikramaditya Singh Jude is still absconding. Any leads whatsoever Rohit so far by the police or are they so completely clueless that they've put a reward of 5,000 rupees for information and are expecting to get people to help them. Well, Shiva, I was speaking to the SP of uh, Jashpur this afternoon and he was saying that they have got some vital clues and leads as far as whereabouts of uh, Vikramaditya Singh is concerned. And he also disclosed that last night they were very close in na close to nabbing him, but yeah. somehow he got a uh, tip off and information and he escaped from that uh, place. But the police is maintaining that they have got some clues, the vital leads, and he will be arrested uh, very shortly. But there are also pressure that is being mounted on the, on the police yes. because the family is saying that because the, it, the, the royal family is involved in this and that is why the police was going slow in this but the police maintained that there was absolutely no pressure and they were hunting for Vikram Aditya Singh in all the three districts that is Chhattisgarh, Odisha you know, and but Rohit, people are very scared there I mean the been... police might finally be able to catch him but so powerful is this family obviously that you know nobody is coming forward to help they're all really really scared about the consequences Well, absolutely. This royal family enjoys a huge clout in this area and that is why people are not coming out in the open to speak too much uh, on this entire issue. Uh, but the, uh, but the, the, the Rajya Sabha BJP MP today, uh, in fact, Ran Vijay Singh, he went to the Gupta family and he was meeting them and he consoled them about the entire incident that has happened. Yeah. He also went to Rachi today to meet the uh, victim there and he, was, and he was saying that the victim is recuperating well and he will be fine very soon. So at this point of time, the all 
eyes are now where is Vikramaditya Singh and his two accomplices and pressure is mounting on police because 48 have, uh, hours have already elapsed and still there right. is no clue where to where, as to where Vikramaditya Singh is. Well, we hope that the police keeps its word and will be able to hunt him down tomorrow. The coward is still on the run. The family says they have no idea where he is, but they've appealed, so-called appealed for him to surrender himself. Rohit, thanks very much for joining us on that story. We'll keep a track of that and get you an update on that tomorrow.